Thinking aloud. Conversations on the leading edge of knowledge and discovery with psychologist Jeffrey Mishlove. Then there's the another human form called soul fragments, and it's when when a person has a very emotional or physical trauma occur. Mm -hmm. Part of their soul may fragment, and that fragment may leave and not return, and many times goes into the lower astral plane, just like the earthbound spirits do, and mm -hmm. finds somebody and attached to them. A fragment of a soul. A fragment of a well, soul. Well, I, I know the Egyptians have, for example, <laughs> ten different words for different aspects mm -hmm. of, of the soul. I don't know that an aspect and a fragment are mm -hmm. quite the same. Well, th what they're saying is that there's a portion of that soul that uh, attaches. So what When we you say what they're saying, who is they? Well, wait a minute. I'm, well, let me say um, the soul fragment leaves and attaches to people, and what we do is we we remove that fragment. And the way I do it is I tell them look for a silver thread that leads um, uh, away, that silver thread that um, leads away from you, and follow that thread to your original soul. Okay. And when they get there. Um, the soul welcomes and embraces the fragment, uh -huh. gives it a gift uh -huh. of love and security, and uh -huh. and the fragment is given a um, is um, gives a gift to the soul too of lightheartedness. And and this is all reported back to you under hypnosis. And this is called the soul retrieval. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm doing all this under hypnosis. Then I ask after I get all the fragments taken care of and they're gone, I ask this very guy, is this patient that I'm working on been fragmented too? Yeah. Yes, several times. Mm -hmm. So then we do another retrieval, but it's a little different. I ask them to look for silver threads that lead from you, um, uh, and um, if you see a larger one, follow that and re-experience the trauma that went with that fragmentation. Mm -hmm. And if it happened when you were very young, uh, the subpersonality needs to know that it survived. Kind of thing, and then, and then follow each. Well, just grab each silver thread that you see and pull each one towards you. And when it gets back, you exchange the same gifts. You give the love and security, and receive the lightheartedness. And when it's all completed, the soul retrieval is complete, and the soul is now complete. And when you're a complete soul, you're no less. You're not vulnerable anymore to entity infestation. But when you're fragmented, you're very vulnerable. That's mm -hmm. why they end up getting dark forces and earthbounds and everything else. So if you're traumatized you, and you've got fragmentation occurring, you're just in trouble. Mm -hmm. There's several things that um, increase your vulnerability. And uh, one is if you're under general anesthesia. Mm -hmm. One is if you're fragmented. Mm -hmm. um, one is if you're using um, really... Um, very deep emotional negative phrases like you know if you're enraged you know that kind of mm -hmm. thing um, you're susceptible to being you're, uh, you're, you're opening yourself to to invaded to, by that's right yeah earthbound spirits that are looking for a home that's right mm-hmm 